everybody, Jared here from Brickhouse Media, and we're super excited to have Event Santa Cruz come to our office today and talk to us about VCTC, the video creator training course here in Santa Cruz. Because Event Santa Cruz is such a big supporter of local businesses, and we are out to support local business, it's a perfect synergy. And today, we're gonna give Matthew, the fun host of Event Santa Cruz, a little tutorial of how do you shoot an interview with one person to make it look like you're being interviewed off camera, and how do you set up for a two-person interview in a really easy, fun way, so stay tuned for that and just excited to host Matthew he's great and Event Santa Cruz is such a great again supporter of local businesses like our own and we're now celebrating 10 years five of it here in Santa Cruz so stay tuned for this we know you're gonna love it and it applies to any business who can leverage video for their marketing and the VCTC training course here in Santa Cruz coming this spring stay tuned I'm here with my buddy Matthew today from Event Santa Cruz. Thank you for coming by. Oh no, thank you for having me. <laughs> We're launching a video creator training course here in Santa Cruz. And one of the things I love about the business and about video is teaching folks like yourself. Teach sweet leverage video in a more inspiring, empowering way. Thinking of ideas like, oh, maybe I hadn't thought of that. Maybe that's something I could do for my business. So today we're gonna do a quick little tutorial about how to do an off-camera interview, which means you're looking off camera no one's actually interviewing Matthew today. He's going to interview himself. <laughs> and it's going to look like he's getting interviewed by a major media outlet. Let's do it. How good? Most business owners love being interviewed. They love the interview. Do they? Well, yeah, because they don't feel as much pressure to look directly into the camera. That is true. There's something about not feeling and looking directly into the camera is, is more of a direct sales approach. Yeah. More emotional. Yeah but you feel more relaxed when you don't have to look at the camera. Oh, right. 100% agree. Okay, so we've got two cameras gone. The Matthew's camera is kind of showing the set here. So we've set it so there's a nice background behind Matthew. We've got one camera on a tripod. So if you don't know about a tripod for your camera, please, that's the number one thing. And we've got a microphone here on Matthew. It's kind of hidden behind him so that his audio is good. So two really important things, right? Microphone, it's within six inches of your mouth a tripod so the camera's not moving, and a little bit of a light so you're not like shaded. Yeah, okay, so we're gonna get started. Let's go. All right. So we're rolling on this camera, we're rolling on this camera, right? So Matthew, you're gonna look like right off camera. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit. Just basically right off camera, just right next to it. Okay. And you're gonna think of some things that you would wanna talk about, like, you're going to talk about, let's see, what's coming up on Friday. All right. But frame it as if you're being asked questions. Okay. So, so what would be a question that you could answer about Friday? Um, about, well, so Matthew, because you have, or you're looking right, oh, right here. here. Yeah. Okay. Never looking at the camera. The camera doesn't exist, which is very hard because I'm used to looking at the yeah. camera. But, but, but this style, I want you to forget this is here and you're talking to a person that's imaginary right here. Okay. Okay. Not at the light because that would be blaring. Yeah. And you can put notes. Which note? We love notes stuck to the light or stuck near it if he forgets his talking points or his questions. Right. Okay. We got it. Okay. So, Matthew, what are some of the, the most exciting events that you produce? Great. And you answer that question. But the key is weave the answer into your question. Okay. I'm sorry. Weave the question into your answer. Okay. Okay. Great. Yeah. So I think out of all the events that, you know, I do, one of the most exciting ones, the one that I'm probably more passionate about than any of the other ones is the Nexties Awards. We've been doing that for the last 11 years. It's super fun because we get to showcase all the amazing people, organizations, businesses that are in our community, and we give them just a moment to shine and showcase them to the world. So it's a really fun event. It's kind of like the Oscars for Santa Cruz doers. Um, and it's coming up very soon. So um, we look forward to having everybody there. Okay, cool. So that's right. That's right. So how did that feel compared to looking directly like at breath and doing like a like a more of a direct video? How did that feel? I think it feels better because usually when you're looking at the camera, yeah, it's like that's in your sense that I'm thinking about. So I'm not 100% thinking about yeah. what I'm saying. Exactly. Yeah. But I'm thinking about Okay, there's a camera there. How do I look? Is my nose big? Are my ears sticking out? I've got, you know, those self dress Exactly. Yeah. Never really, you're like, you're stressed about the actual video portion of it. If I'm just looking to the side, it 
actually does feel a lot more natural. Yeah, yeah let's try one more. Right. Think of a question related to the nexties um, coming up. And we'll try one more. And I'm not going to be here for this one. Okay. So just pretend like I'm not here. You've got your question. And you're going to put your question into the answer. That's okay. It. Okay, so does that have to be about nexties? Can I just put of any sure. else? I think, yeah. Your video. Uh, okay. Um, so I guess the question would be, like, can you tell us a little bit about events, events Santa Cruz, how long it's been around, what do you do, um, and what do you look forward to in the future? Something like that. Um, well, Event Santa Cruz, we actually started about 10 years ago. Uh, this actually is our 10-year anniversary. September 23rd is our, uh, our first time we actually had an event. Um, and from the very beginning, we've been just like we just talked about earlier about the Nexties is we showcase the people in our community. They're doing amazing things. We showcase the doers um, and we gave them a platform to tell their story. And, you know, um, we've changed over the years from speaker series to block parties to uh, doing uh, online, you know, social media, um, just media in general, video and everything just to um, find other ways to tell their stories. But again, it's always about showcasing the people, showcasing the real stories about what they do. Um, and what we plan to do the next 10 years, honestly, I don't know. <laughs> I wish I did know, but we know that this year is going to be a big pivotal change for us so we can keep on doing what we do and um, and do it better. Awesome. Yeah. High five. So how did that feel? Did it feel the same for you as the earlier? Uh, I would say it actually could. Well, because I didn't really re rehearse this or yeah. come up with the question. Didn't I didn't know what I was going to say. Yeah. Things. So, you know, if I did that, that would be a little better. But I felt like the second time I even for me, after you do it once, you do it twice, you get all more comfortable. Yeah. Um, but I felt like this time I even thought less about the camera. You're forgetting business. Yeah, so getting more and more, yeah. So which kind of tells you too, the more you do it, you do it a few, two, three, four times, by the fifth time, it's like, I'm just telling you the story. Exactly. Yeah. Whatever. Okay. And so, um, and again, if we did this with a setup, I wouldn't even need you here. No, no, and, and I, obviously I wouldn't be here. Yeah. You would have been a point of it. This yeah. is the full yeah. idea that we want to empower people to create video from anywhere they work now yeah. and create it in different styles. Yeah. So this is one called the interview style, the off-camera interview style. Now in a big shoot, you'd have the interviewer, you'd have you, you'd have three cameras at least shooting. Yeah. This is a way to hack one camera, off-camera, not looking at it, and feel like you're being interviewed. This is amazing. I don't know why I didn't do that. <laughs> yeah. No, no. So these are the kind of things we're going to be talking about. The video creator training course coming up this spring okay. here in Santa Cruz. We're going to have a maximum of 25 people, potentially two dates, maybe April and May. Okay. And yeah, it's perfect for solopreneurs and entrepreneurs and founders, coaches, consultants, people who want to create video, but they're feeling a little bit of a stop. They want to be empowered and they don't want to have to pay for a videographer every time they do a video. Great. Okay. So just, I mean, this is like the... <laughs> Obvious question, but yeah. where do people go to find out more information? So it's just our website, bhmedia.co, and we're going to be having social ads going, and that's an easy place to find out. Put a link in the bottom. I must admit, I don't know where to look now. Camera, <laughs> right there. Where did we look? I didn't know. This, this is what's up. I just screwed up your old pen. <laughs> so thanks to Matt here for Bad Santa Cruz for coming by and being my giddy pig here, hopefully learning something new. I did. And feeling like, ooh, this might be something I could try for my own stuff. I will. Awesome. All right. Thanks, all. Thanks, guys.